So, it's another uh, rant video. I don't do these very often because I don't like seeing myself on video in a bad fucking mood. But, Google, Alphabet, the corporation that owns Google, and YouTube, they're all working hand in hand to shoot each other in the fucking foot. They're upgrading, not upgrade, they're updating their terms of service. Uh, YouTube is making it so that they can put ads on your videos now, even if you're not a part of the uh, partner program, which means they don't have to give you shit. If you've got a thousand subscribers and more than 4,000 view hours on YouTube, then you can become a part of the partner program and make 60% of the ad revenue that comes to your channel. But they decided, nah, let's just fuck over the small creators and not even have any incentive to make them a part of the partner program by just putting ads on their videos, whether they're a partner or not, and not giving them dick. And while at the same time, Google, who owns YouTube, um, is no longer offering up unlimited free storage. Now they want to charge you for what used to be free and still isn't their top tier quality. So now I can't upload anymore. And Google Movie Maker has stopped working. So a video that I was going to upload to my other channel, uh, my motorcycle channel, hasn't had a video on it. Because for the last two, three weeks, I've been waiting for uh, Google Photos Movie Maker to finish my fucking video. It's a bunch of clips. You know, as you know, watching this channel, most of my videos, if not all of them, on this channel anyways are single shot videos. Press record, finish recording, stop, upload. Very simple. I wanted to start improving my videos. You would think that if they're going to start putting ads on anybody's videos, that they would want to make their Google services work more seamlessly, you know, instead of taking a week, how about just use computer processing power, you know, because these are computers, you know, when, when you use an off-site service instead of using, you know, it processing the video on your phone, you do it off-site, it's supposed to make it faster, uh, it doesn't, it's, it's, it's like, Alphabet is directing Google to shoot YouTube in the foot. Alphabet owns Google that owns YouTube. Why would you want to shoot your own damn self in the foot? I realize that as a creator and the videos themselves. So me, I am a product that Google sells. My videos are an enticement, a calling card for me as a product for somebody that they can gather information so that they can sell to my general demographic. I accept that being a, a, a user of a free product, that I am not the user, I'm the product. I get that. So why would they want to make their products less valuable by making it harder for their products to perform well. They're shooting themselves in the foot by making it harder for me to upload videos in a timely and consistent manner. The more viewers I gain from having videos being uploaded in a timely, consistent manner and being higher quality, the more eyes are going to be put in front of ads, potentially. And they're making it basically impossible for me to do that. I'm probably going to switch to TikTok. I realize that in 10 years or 20 years, TikTok will be doing the same annoying, obtrusive, shoot itself in the foot things that Google is. But Google's dying. Alphabet Corporation is dissolving its products. They are making some of their products worthless. Big business. Who knows why they do it? But they are doing it. They are making Google and YouTube be not a thing. It, people always thought that because Google and YouTube was so huge that they would never go away. That's hilarious. 
they're going away right now. They are charging people into their own demise because their products aren't worth charging for. I'm one of those people that, like, say, for example, here's a company that I had tried to invest my time in learning how to use their products. There's a company called Newmark. They, they make DJ equipment, turntables, the, the really, really fancy turntables. But they also released these ones that were being sold at, like, Big Lots. And they were cheap, lightweight, injection-molded plastic including the platter that the record's supposed to sit on. So you'd go to put your hand on this thing to do a scratch, and it would bounce the needle right off of the table because it was a total fucking piece of garbage. Now I realize that the top-of-the-line turntable that they sell for several thousand dollars is not going to perform that well. But as a customer, a potential customer, I'm going to look at the cheapest shit you license your name to or the crappiest product that you yourself make, and I'm going to judge the potential of your most expensive product to be able to satisfy me over a long period of time. I'm going to judge that based on how well does this cheap injection molded plastic piece of shit work. It doesn't, so I won't buy any of Newmark's products, ever. They're garbage. Remington licenses their name to garbage. They licensed their name to a company that made lawnmowers. And those lawnmowers were all recalled. And it started to fall apart so quickly that Remington sold off that division to some company that did not have to honor the warranty. So all these people had broken mowers that were fucked. Now, I realize that the company, the part of the company that makes firearms and knives and shit, that's not the same. They just licensed their name to some fly-by-night company. The fact that they did that means that, like, they used to have really nice knives that I used to buy. You know, I can't buy guns. But I used to have, you know, I won't buy those anymore. Absolutely not. And if I was ever, if, please, I implore you people, don't buy a Remington firearm. They have to be garbage. Because look at that mower. That mower was garbage. They put their name on that mower. It's garbage. I won't buy one of their razors either. One of those fucking, no, hell no, I ever want to start shaving this. No, not going to be a Remington. Google is going away. Google is shooting itself in the foot. Google is shooting YouTube in the foot. And it's at the direction of the main company that owns the alphabet. Fuck them. The next YouTube is going to be TikTok. It's it's clear. And I don't think that Google is going to be in a position to buy them. Because they suck so bad, they're having to charge for their shittiest services. Rant over. Uh, like, dislike. But if you dislike, let me know what you dislike about it. You know, just the general dis the rant video or my actual opinions. Let me know. There are, there is a comment section.